Since it's over 10, it's over 7. Since it's a level 11 with this level 9. You guys do that. Yeah, we look real spiffy now. We got all the armor. We got we're, we're armored out. We got weapons. We got a crossbow. Armor definitely looks way better in this game than it did in uh, Brotherhood and Assassin's Creed 2. It's not as bulky. Fire in your hand, old man. <laughs> it should have been destroyed. Destroy the only thing capable of ending the Crusades and creating true peace? Never. Forgive me for this, mentor. But the apple corrupted you, and through you it would have corrupted us. For us to live, you had to die. Is it truly over? Is that sorcerer dead? He was no sorcerer, just an ordinary man in command of illusions. <coughs> have you prepared the pyre? I have, but... Altair, some of the men will not stand for such a thing. Let me handle it. Are you fit to travel? Well enough, yes. I asked Malik to ride to Jerusalem with news of Al-Mulim's death. Would you ride to Acre and do the same? Of course. How did it come to this? My mind was clear, but my body, it would not move. Was our mentor the cause of this confusion? Yes. Do not believe What has happened here? Our mentor deceived us all. The Templars corrupted him. Where is your proof? Walk with me, Abbas, and I will explain. And if I find your answers wanting, I will talk until you are satisfied. Do you remember the artifact we recovered from Robert de Saab in Solomon's temple? The artifact you were sent to retrieve? What others deliver? Yes. It is a Templar tool. <laughs> the Apple of Eden. It can conjure illusions and control men's minds. A deadly weapon. And you believe Al Moalim fell under its spell? I do. Today yeah. he used the Apple to enslave Masyaf. You saw that for yourself. I do not know what I saw. Listen, Abbas. The Apple is safe in Al Moalim's study. When I am finished here, I will. Show you all I know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Altair! No! I must know that he cannot return. But this is not our way. To burn a man's body is forbidden. 
Defiler! Hear me out. This body could be another one of Al Mulim's phantoms. I must be certain. Lies! All your life, you have made a mockery of our creed. You bend the rules to suit your whims, while belittling and humiliating <laughs> those around you. Restrain him! Did you not hear him? Al Mualim is bewitched. Oh shit. What did I tell you, Altair? Abbas, stop! What did you think would happen when you murdered our beloved mentor? You loved that belief less than anyone. You blamed him for all your misfortune, even your father's suicide. My father was a hero! This is not the time to quarrel over the past. We must decide what to do with that weapon. <laughs> Whatever this artifact is capable of, you are not worthy to wield it! No man is. Oh, he's beautiful, is it not? He has a weak mind, he can't uh, comprehend it. Okay, we have we have we we have a lot of time. Aha. Yeah, only if it's Altair's time and Altair only. I don't care what anyone says. Like, it wor looks weird on everyone, especially Ayak. <laughs> Altair. <laughs> Barely 26 and already a Grandmaster in command of a divided order. How does one cope with such responsibility and unlimited power? Sequence complete. I 
I've made the acquaintance of an Ottoman prince named Suleiman. He's a clever young man, with a fortitude uncommon for his age. On his suggestion, I will be investigating some wayward Janissaries, who may be in league with the Templars. With luck, they will lead me straight to the core of the Templars' leadership. Meanwhile, the Venetian Sophia Sartor continues to help me find the hidden Maziaf keys. She is a diligent woman, full of passion and vigor, and I enjoy her company immensely. But I dare not tell her the purpose of my stay here, nor of my true vocation. Those who do not volunteer in our struggle should not be forced to fight it. My sir has to stop, let's go do it. Mentor, I am told you still have the speed and strength of a 20-year-old. I try to keep healthy. Mm -hmm. Then how about a race? I could use a bit of exercise. You begin, and I will follow. The Templar is up to something. We should track him. Yes, sir.
not let him escape. Hey, I can handle him. this, mentor. Motherfucker. He was holding this, mentor. It must belong to the vizier he robbed. You take care of this body. I will return this Yes, document. I do. This belongs to you. Ah, you have spared me much humiliation before the Sublime Port. Thank you, Effendim. And is that the young assassin who aided you today? Enjoy the rest of your day. Mentor, I have heard some troubling rumors. Tell me. About... We have reason to believe a rogue Orthodox deacon is planning to murder the Patriarch of Constantinia. Do we know who this deacon is? Not yet. Clues have been sparse. We need a name first. It would not serve our cause to eliminate every holy man between Bursa and Belgrado. Vieni, and we will ask around to see what we can learn. What is our plan, Mentor? The Orthodox millet in the city is too small to hide big secrets. We will ask the clergy some questions, and, if necessary, make them answer. Is in danger from a rogue decoy. Does 
that stir any ideas? Ah, yes. We have heard those rumors, too. And the name behind them is Ulrich Cyril of Rhodes. The Patriarch cast him out some years ago for gross misdeeds. He has vanished. Anathema. If you see him in the city, you can be sure he intends to do harm. What did you learn? Our target is Cyril of Rhodes, a banished deacon. number of holy men here. I know what to do, Mentor. And if I see an opportunity to eliminate him, I will take it. No. Not our target! Dumbass. Brash fool. You killed an innocent man. I have no excuse, Mentor. Forgive me. Even if I do, many others will not. Nor should they. Take up his body and bring him to the shore. This is your burden to bear. Why do I have to? It was his stupid mistake. Have I somehow annoyed you, sir? Amusing. God, please help me now. Must get out of here. Commit this poor man to the sea, then meditate on your mistake. Have it, Mentor. May the shame I feel never fade. Uh, 
don't know. I force me up. <laughs> Doing this will actually give us something really fucking nice, so. Watch how we're doing the Master Assassin shit. Most wait for level 10 plus assassins to complete a contract in the Mediterranean before starting a master assassin. Oh, these guys. I'm a dumbass. I can't believe I forgot about that. So if we remember to do in the meantime. Another 
Yes, another man of indeed. Let's work on lowering an aura at least. Some respect for your fellow man, no? Over there. Right. Spiffy now. I do whatever I want, bitch. I own this place, motherfucker. Shit. I was nowhere close. <laughs> like, goddamn. Why is he familiar? I'm not familiar, though. You don't know me. Oh. 
Excuse me. Pardon me, Sayonara. Forgive my insignificance. Salute. I am closing in on two more books. One near Topkapa and the other in the Bayzid district. Bayzid first. Topkapa will be a dead end. Ah, see. Si. What do you make of this? Oh, Ezio. Incredibile. Early Coptic bindings. Still in good shape. Amazing. This must be a third century transcription of the original. Sophia, what happened here? Oh, that happens once or twice a year. People break in thinking they will find money. I do not keep much here, but this time they made off with a portrait of some value. It is a shame. You keep working. I will find your painting. Ezio, the thief could be anywhere by now. If the thief came for money, but took a painting, he should be close by, eager to get rid of it. Well, if you happen <coughs> to find it within the next few hours, meet me by the aqueduct. I will be running errands. Motherfucker stole painting. Motherfucker. I'm gonna I'm kill him. Not need to. I will just keep hitting you until you talk. <coughs> I do not care how you got the painting. Just tell me where it is. I sold it to a merchant in the bazaar. How else will I feed myself? <laughs> Next time, find a nicer way to be a canalia. I should kill you. No, I'm gonna kill you. I Alright. Let's go get that painting back. I have a painting for that, if you are curious. A luminous point. You see how light that she looks and beauty shines through. I don't care, I bought it. I really don't care. I had enough, so I bought the shit. <laughs> It is a good likeness, don't you think? I prefer the original. Buffone. <laughs> this was a gift from my father for my 28th birthday. I had <coughs> to sit for Messer Albrecht Durer for a full week. Can you imagine me sitting still for seven days doing nothing? I cannot. Una tortura. <laughs> so, I found you another book location. And it is not far from here, actually. Grazie. Ezio, <laughs> what is this all about? You are not a scholar, that much is clear. Do you work for the church? <laughs> not the church, no. <laughs> But I am a teacher, of a kind. I will explain one day, Sophie. Things are much better.
I'm sorry, but you guys aren't allowed up here. <laughs> I love doing that. I love fucking with NPCs. Yeah, I am on load latency. Dumbass. <laughs> Ahmed will shortly be overseeing a review of Sitzhaft. What on earth is he doing? Okay. Let's see here. Oh yeah, it's looking better now. quiet today not remotely a heated conflict is brewing between two factions of Romanis one group has banded together against a woman they call Mirella accusing her of swindling the poor on dozens of occasions as we speak they are on the way to exile this trickster by force if necessary by your tone you seem to believe there will be trouble I do <laughs> Mirella is a frightening woman and her temper is well known I fear for anyone who crosses her then we should give these Romanis our support. No good can come of this fight if it escalates. Right. Let's go save people, I guess. We can escort the Romanis to the meeting and provide protection until the impasse is resolved. A wise plan, but only in secret. If Mirella gets wind that the assassins are aiding her opposition, there is no telling what she might do. There they are. How should we proceed? You take to the rooftops, and I will wander the streets. Evet, Mentor. If I see any trouble stirring, I will provide a distraction. I love this sword and dagger. Jesus Christ. So far so good, you know?
you defile our people? How dare you turn the city against us simply to satisfy your greed? Keep your voice down. You know nothing of my motives. I will not be silent! This woman is a trickster, a cheat. She robs the poor of their money by preying on their fears! I will regret taking that tone with me. Alright. What's wrong? She's poisoned. Ah. Murderers! <coughs> Surrender yourselves! Stop right there! He did nothing! Protect the Romanis, but do not harm the guards. This is a grave misunderstanding. Dumbass bitch. What? What did I do? I don't know why you did, but okay. Protect the Romans, but do not harm the guards. This is a grave misunderstanding. Okay. Soldiers, in your haste to serve justice, you let the real murderer slip away. These I, women I are innocent. I just have to disarm. I thought he... Stop it before this gets out of hand. <laughs> I give you my word, Mentor. Bene. We will speak again soon. All right. Let's go. That was Duchio. You know? I learned it. Time to leave. I am such a. Let me get out of your way. That's right. You better get out of my way, bitch. Buongiorno. How have you taken to your new post? I do my best, Ezio, but it huh? is no easy task to oversee a district in constant peril. Peril? What has happened? Despite our presence, the influence of Templar money is strong. Most of the merchants here are still taking bribes. Narazione. We should talk to the people and get a feeling for their mood. Vieni. 
Most of the merchants who have sold their allegiance are Greek. And I am not ashamed to say that I understand why. I have done nothing wrong, I swear. There we go. You are a better citizen than most Damn. of them. We cannot expect men to find any comfort in having been conquered. But just as they have a right to demand dignity from the Ottomans, oh, the Byzantines have an obligation to keep the innocent safe from harm. This requires a careful balancing act. We should not be surprised if we stumble from time to time. Where to go? May the father of understanding guide and keep you. This is an impressive take for a single day. What business is it of yours how quickly I make my money? I take care of my neighbors, and they take care of me. Insignia on this chest. What does it mean? That? Hmm. It is the seal of Theodoros Komnenos. And he is your benefactor. Benefactor? Oh, he. He is my <laughs> friend, my countryman, and one of the wealthiest men in this district, despite our new masters. Of course. Grazie. <laughs> what do you think? Shall we pay Theodoros a visit? I do not want to start the fight. We cannot justify Ezio. Nor do I. If we can find a way Bro. to avoid bloodshed, we will. But if the temple is behind, it's gonna be a fuchsio. It's a bullshit. I want a recount and a remap. <sighs> Gotta do this again. May the Father of Understanding guide and keep you. This is an impressive take for a single day. What business is it of yours how quickly I make my money? I take care of my neighbors, and they take care of me. Damn. How did you come across this incredible sum of money? Where did you learn your manners, Italian? In a court of what? Bless you, brother. May God shine his radiance upon you. A large sum for him as well. Salute, amico. Forgive me for asking, but the insignia on this chest, what does it mean? That? It is the seal of Theodoros Komnenos. And he is your benefactor. Benefactor? Oh, he. He is my friend, my countryman, and one of the wealthiest men in this district, despite our new masters. Of course. Grazie. What do you think? Shall we pay Theodoros a visit? I do not want to start a fight. We cannot justify Ezio. Nor do I. And if we can find a way to avoid bloodshed, we will. But if the Templars are behind this, that will give us few options. Right. Oh my god. Why would you save yourself this way, that old man? Wait, get out of my way. You good? Remember how to climb now? Mm. 
We could have just tripped a zipline. Okay. Jesus Christ, I thought I was gonna fucking stumble and fall. <laughs> like, hurry up, lady. Assassins would like to know what your generosity has purchased. Assassins? <laughs> you? Both of you? Yes. Call, Nathende. We mean no harm. I don't want to die. Please, spare my troubled soul. The Templars have corrupted me. I'm a good man at heart. Keep watch over this one. When he has regained his sanity, we will talk. Thank you. 